Hello everyone, back again with, once again with Jeremy. Um, so today is actually something that kind of is not directly, directly related to your goals and to getting where you want to be. Um, it's something that can kind of get lost in the shuffle and it's something that you can forget about, but it's a very important aspect of this growing as a person and moving forward. And what I'm talking about is focusing on taking care of yourself. And what I mean by this is not necessarily, we talked about the three different levels of health, but this is also, I guess it'd be kind of mental health also. It's, you know, relationships with others. So as you go through this process of figuring out your goals and focusing on them and moving towards them, you have a tendency to get tunnel vision or like a horse with blinders on you don't really get to see what's going on around you and because of this you can actually start to lose pieces of yourself i guess um you start to lose possible connections with other people that you had that were important um, we've talked about friends and the different friends that don't necessarily need to be in your life but the ones that do now what I'm talking about is you need to actually take some time and step away from your goals. If your goals are, like I always use the example, make a million dollars. That's great. And your goals is often like a chess game. You're looking one, two, six steps ahead to get to the next part of your goal, to get to the next goal. While you're doing this, you could actually lose sight of you know, your family and your friends um, I've even had the point where my friends considered me kind of obnoxious because all I did was I talked about my goal and what I was doing and where I was going. You know, I never step, stepped back and I talked to them about what they were doing and what, what they were, you know, looking forward to and doing and, you know, things like that. And I, another thing is I love to fish and I got to the point that I, I, I stopped fishing and I didn't do anything that I just enjoyed, that I stepped back, you know, this this beast mode, don't stop till you're there, all this stuff, that's great, but if you lose yourself in the process of getting to your big goal, what's the point? What's the point of being unhappy and having absolutely nobody in your life and losing the connections you have with, and if you have a million dollars, what, what good is that? That's not, that's not good. What are you gonna, who are you gonna share it with? So you need to step back. And I'm not saying take a day, take a week, take a month, you know, take a little bit of time, you know, go to a barbecue once a month or something, hang out with your friends, take a half a day, go fishing, you know, do those things. Now, you can take a Sunday off and do whatever you want and then get laser focused again on Monday. It's not going to hurt you, I promise. It'll, it might even revitalize your uh, passion for your goal. You know, we talk about motivation is is only limited, but your commitment is what's important. Well, maybe the taking that day off and being able to see your goal from the outside or see your goal from other people's perspective, maybe that'll give you the motivation again to get going really hard again. So you need to take some time. You need to think about yourself just for a little while and regain those connections. You need to, you know, step back and do something you enjoy that's not necessarily re directly related to your goal you're gonna feel better, you're gonna feel recharged, and it's important. So, think about this often. Think about, you know, the things that you're willing, everything has, you know, every action has a consequence, and if you get laser focused, there's gonna be a consequence. There's gonna be the consequence of hopefully getting closer to your goal, but there's also gonna be a negative consequence of possibly losing people you love or losing part of yourself. So take your time, look at that, and like I said, be laser focused, nothing wrong with that, but every once in a while, once a month or so, step back. Enjoy that beer with your friends, you know, and then get back on it. So today, we're working on your, on your personal well-being, so you work on that. Um, don't do it every day, don't do it every week. You're going to end up falling off the wagon, because I'll tell you right now, going to barbecues and Drinking beers with the buddies is way easier than staying focused on your goals. It's, um, it's, it's just easier. It's not. It's a comfortable thing. And like we've talked about before, life only gets better when you're uncomfortable. So 
step back for a day, for a couple hours, just relax, and then get back on it. Focus hard and get to your goals. Love you guys. If I can do anything for you, you know, subscribe to the channel. I'm trying to do these daily. I'm keeping up pretty good. I think I've missed one day, maybe, maybe two days. But help me out. Subscribe to the channel. Leave me some comments. Find me on Facebook. Um, some of you guys are doing that, and you guys are giving me some good ideas. I'm hoping next weekend I can do like a longer one, maybe a stand-up where we go over a couple different things. So I appreciate you guys' times. You know, focus on yourself just for a couple hours, just for a day. Do yourself a favor and do it. I love you guys. If I can do anything for you, let me know.